In my previous video on the Greater Southern Waterfront video series, I mentioned the immense potential of District 3 and 5. You know, if you study the transaction volumes of new home sales over the first nine months of 2019, you will notice that District 3 and 5 are among the top three best-selling districts for new launches. In fact, when you study the transaction value of District 3, tops the chart at more than 2.1 billion and District 5 ranks third at more than 1.4 billion. This reflects the confidence and the demand that the market is placing on these two neighboring districts. So in this video, let's find out what's the driving force behind the demand in District 3. Now, speaking of District 3, you probably would have at least heard of two of the new launches that have set single-day impressive sales records. Avenue South residents sold more than 90% of the 300 initial release units on launch day, and One Pearl Bank sold 160 units out of the 200 units released on the first day of launch. Now, one key development to take note in D3 is the SGH campus. SGH campus is located right opposite One Pearl Bank. Now, this is not just another hospital, it is Singapore's largest medical hub, occupying a site of 43 hectares. Now, that is about the size of 43 football fields. SGH healthcare facilities will triple in size and will move closer to Outram MRT station and public transport nodes. The entire medical campus will be classified under three zones, the education zone, research zone, and the patient care zone. And this will create a vibrant world-class healthcare ecosystem. As a property investors, you can imagine the huge pool of medical professionals that you can immediately tap on for the rental of your investment properties. Another key development in D3 is Pearl's Hill City Park, seamlessly linked to One Pearl Bank. Residents can look forward to city living amid a large garden settings with the city park transformed into a playground and social space for residents and public alike. It will also connect to Fort Canning Park via Singapore River, making a walk from hill to hill a reality. At this point, I would also like to draw attention to Thompson East Coast 9, or TEL in short. Among the many TEL stations, we see some distinctive ones such as Orchard Station, Great World Station, and Halflock Station. Ladies and gentlemen, there are lots of plans coming up above the TEL stations. In fact, there are white sites of vacant land parcels that have not yet been officially planned yet. Think about it. What could be the impact of Thompson East Coast 9? You know, it is way bigger than what we could have imagined. Just take a look at the site where One Pearl Bank lies. There are many plots for future development on top of Outram MRT station, which is, by the way, also a triple nine MRT interchange. It is common knowledge that when you have new MRT stations, you will have new amenities around the stations. A similar story could be seen from the current site of Avenue South Residence. In fact, there are speculations on the location of the missing NE2 station and the many possibilities on the land parcels around the development. And from past experience, you will also notice that the authorities will usually start planning for the MRT stations first before planning for the land parcels around them. Ladies and gentlemen, we don't have to be a genius to realize that once those plots and amenities are planned and built, the land prices around those areas will experience another surge. My question to you is, what do you think the future land price and property prices will be? Another interesting fact actually comes from the HDB resale figures. It is very rare that HDB prices cross the $1 million mark. However, you'll notice that a large number of non-DBSS HDB $1 million transactions come from District 3 and 5, namely Tiong Bahru, Queenstown, and Clementi. Ladies and gentlemen, what I have presented to you are cohort facts and figures. If you still harbor the thought that prices are still high now, be prepared for more jaw-dropping figures a few more years down the road. 
My name is PK So. I hope this video sheds some light on the immense potential of District 3. Please feel free to visit my website, Singapore, greatersouthernwaterfront.com or feel free to drop me a message on my cell phone at 9697-1131. I look very much forward to meeting you in person and assisting you in your real estate needs.